let's try one of the best questions in director circle which was asked in G 1997 here is the question read the statement of question carefully the question is a tangent to ellipse x square plus 4y square is equal to 4 meets the ellipse x square plus 2y square is equal to 6 at points P and Q we have to prove that tangents at P and Q to this second ellipse are at right angle when tangents to any ellipse are perpendicular we know the concept of director circle is directly involved okay so we will have solution of this question using director circle concept let's draw the diagram according to data the given ellipses are to draw the ellipse we first put the ellipse equation in the standard form for that first equation we will divide throughout by 4 we have ellipse x square by 4 plus y square by y is equal to 1 let's draw this ellipse here is the ellipse with vertices 2 and minus 2 here the value of a is 2 and b is 1 second ellipse e2 is x square by 6 plus y square by 3 is equal to 1 here is the ellipse e2 with vertices root 6 and minus root 6 this ellipse is bigger because uh, values of a and b both are greater than those of this ellipse e1 now according to question we will be drawing tangent to ellipse e1 so we have tangents to ellipse e1 at point r meets the ellipse e2 at points p and q hum ellipse e1 ke kisi point r pe tangent draw karte hain here is tangent jo ellipse e2 ko p and q point pe intersect kar raha hai okay now we will be drawing tangents to ellipse e2 at p and q let's draw the tangents tangents at p and q are intersecting at point t now we have to prove that this tangents are perpendicular that means tangents pt and qt are perpendicular now perpendicular tangents of ellipse intersect on director circle so here point t will lie on director circle of ellipse e2 so to solve this question we will prove that locus of point t is director circle of ellipse e2 agar hum prove kar dete hain ki t point ka locus ellipse e2 ka director circle hai to ye prove ho jayega ki tangents pt and qt are perpendicular okay so now what is director circle of e2 kisi bhi ellipse ka director circle kya hota hai x square plus y square is equal to a square plus b square so here the director circle will be x square plus y square is equal to 6 plus 3 which okay now our task is to find the locus of point t say point t is equal to h comma k okay how we find the locus of this point any idea to find the locus of this point in coded geometry we have many common uh, methods to find the locus okay focus on line pq okay pq line is what pq line is uh, tangent to ellipse e1 at point r so let's find equation of this consider point r to be any general point of the ellipse what is that 2 cos theta comma sin theta we are taking this point r in parametric form jab bhi kisi ellipse ke par koi general point lena ho to hum usko parametric form mein lete now what is equation of tangent x upon a cos theta plus y upon b sin theta is equal to 1 here a and b are 2 and 1 respectively okay we got the equation of line pq now pq is also one important line in this diagram with respect to some other point what is that with respect to point t what is pq 
इट इज कॉर्ड ऑफ कॉन्टेक्ट ऑफ इलिप्स ई टू है ना लाइन पी क्यू इज कॉर्ड ऑफ कॉन्टेक्ट ऑफ इलिप्स ई टू विद रिस्पेक्ट टू पॉइंट टी हाउ यू गेट इक्वेशन ऑफ कॉर्ड ऑफ कॉन्टेक्ट बाय द वे By replacement method, we replace x square by x x one, y square by y y one. So, chord of contact PQ with respect to point T for ellipse E two is h x by six plus k y by three is equal to one. Ellipse E two के अंदर हम x square को h x and y square को k y से replace करेंगे. Okay. Now we got the equation of PQ. We have two equations for the same straight line. जब किसी same straight line के लिए अगर हमें दो equations मिलते हैं, definitely those two equations will be same. So for that we will compare the ratio of coefficients. So what we get from first equation we have cos theta by two. From second equation we have h by six for coefficient of x. Comparing this, uh, getting this ratio, cos theta by two upon h by six, which will be equal to sine theta by one upon k by three. And from constant term we have one. One upon one is one. Okay. So from this we will get values of cos theta and sine theta. From this we will get three cos theta is equal to h, and three sine theta is equal to k. Now we have to find the locus of point T. That means we have to get relation between h and k. How we get? If we remove this variable theta. How we remove this theta? We have three cos theta, three sine theta. We have very simple elimination here. That is squaring and adding. Okay, so by squaring and adding, we get nine cos square theta plus nine sine square theta is equal to h square k square. So LHS is nine. So the locus is x square plus y square is equal to nine. हमने t point का locus निकाल दिया और ये locus in fact ellipse e two का director circle है है ना? That means tangents are perpendicular. जो हमें prove करना था वो हमने किस तरह से prove किया? We found the locus of point t. Which is director circle. Hence, tangents are perpendicular. 